My view is we should call it ZAS. What are we talking about? ASP, MSP, On Demand, Service Bureau, Software as a Service, but that excludes data, doesn't it? Hardware as a Service, HAS, Data Service, Internet Service, Outsourced Business Service. I like ZAS. X is a service. Pronounce ZAS. What do you think? Regardless of the name, there are different perspectives on what ZAS is. My view is that it comes over if it comes over a wire and can be consumed by a machine or a human via a machine, then it's ZAS. It could also be aggregated in different ways. For example, it could have data, application logic, people. It could feed another set of data, applica application logic, and people. And that could feed another set of data application logic and people. <coughs> you could have a whole set of data application logic and people interacting in various ways that could get quite complex over time. There might not be a human user, but if there is, it could be a PDA in different forms, a laptop, a desktop, a car, refrigerator, a stove. It could be consumed via a browser, a rich client. It just doesn't matter. Finally, the service could be consumed by computers, consumers, businesses, still all ZAS. Now you know what I mean when I call something ZAS. It means any end tier or other network topology combination of data and or application logic and or people with or without a human user, possibly using a smartphone, PDA, laptop, desktop, car or refrigerator, using a browser or rich client consumed by consumers, business users, users and or computers. ZAS. Some examples, Google, Yahoo, Monster, FeedBurner, Citadon, Hitwise, Canoodle, Nestivo, WordPress, VeriSign, Salesforce.com, Hotmail, ExactTarget, Salary.com, CallWave, Metadata, Procuri, Windows Live, MSN, Zenga, and many, many others. All ZAS.